Welcome to another edition of Under the Microscope. Today I have the pleasure of being with Ms. Alicia Schiller, who's the Vice President of our student government and a student in one of our doctoral programs. Welcome to Under the Microscope and thanks so much for taking a few minutes to be with us today. Absolutely, thank you for having me. So what I wanted to talk to you a little bit about is this new app that's available for these mobile smartphones mm -hmm. that's coming out from the University of Nebraska Medical Center. And maybe you could tell me a little bit about the role that student government had in developing the idea for this app. Right, absolutely. So at the beginning of this term for Student Senate, uh, myself and President Krupa Savalia, we, um, we really wanted to see this idea come to fruition. So um, we have a committee structure in Student Senate and I head the issues committee. So what we did is got support of this committee and actually spent a couple of months um, kind of figuring out what we would like to see in the app, how we would like to see this developed. And then uh, Krupa and I figured out what steps we needed to take, who we needed to talk to to kind of get that idea rolling. And what happened since then? Are we close? Absolutely. Um, I'm amazed at the speed of progress we've made. So um, we started our Senate, president, our Senate term in January, and this app will actually roll out for the new student class um, by August. Boy, that's exciting. Yeah. So can you tell our audience a couple of things that are in the app? Because uh, they, they probably don't really know. Right, so one of the driving forces that the students really wanted to see in this new mobile app was because we're such a diverse body of students, it's very difficult for us to kind of coordinate schedules, um, figure out what's going on on campus from the DRC research side to the Sorrel side and kind of get everybody coordinated. So one of the really great features, I think the app will incorporate more of an inter-campus um, communication between all of the students. So we're very excited for that. And I understand it has a piece on student health and it has a couple of safety pieces as well as uh, other athletic events that are available in the region, is that right? Yes, absolutely. Boy, that's exciting. Is it available for all platforms or is it just available for one or the other? No, it should know? be available for all platforms, yes. So Alicia, do you know when the uh, app is going to be available to our students and it's to our actually, faculty? It's actually available right now. Oh, isn't that fantastic? Mm -hmm. Well, listen, I'd like to take this moment to thank you and to thank Krupa for all of your support in helping us build that. I've spoken with the people in our information technology group, and they say that without the student input, this would have been impossible to do. So they're very proud of it, and I know you are too. Great, thank and you. And thanks so much for being with me today on Under the Microscope.